Hey, all my movie maniacs out there, it is I, is that time, and yes, two more from the Yashkosh Horror Film Festival. We've got Barbecue Massacre and Cluster. Now, Barbecue uh, Massacre was part of a 48-hour film challenge. It's brought to us by directors Tony Walsh and Brian Wolford, who, uh, Brian Wolford also wrote this and tells us the story of these folks who uh, had rented, or, or excuse me, had bought an RV and then invited some friends over for uh, a grill out, a cookout to celebrate the RV and kind of just enjoy the outdoors. Well, they find that they get more than they bargained for with this RV and things start happening, mean nasty things to the new owners of the RV. Uh, I really liked this uh, film, really. I mean, again, it's another lower budget film, but done really well. It's it's just this neat little tale, and a pretty creepy tale, that will make you wonder about, uh, you know, buying an RV from someone. Uh, the dialogue is pretty good. It's a lot of fun. You felt some chemistry between these folks. Now, with it being a 48-hour film challenge, they didn't have a lot of time to put this film together. But I'll tell you, they did very well for the time frame that they had to go from start to finish with a film, okay? Uh, they kept it simple. They worked within their budget. And it works well. You, you buy that this is a group of friends just sitting around having a cookout. And there's even some gore in here for you, some some decent gore effects. I really liked how it was directed and how they handled uh, the, the death scenes in here. Uh, I'm not spoiling it. It's called Barbecue Massacre for a reason, folks. But overall, it was really well put together, especially for the time frame they had. And I really enjoyed this film. It's just a lot of fun, and I think you will too if you can catch the film online uh, or at a festival. Now, another film that was shown at the Ashkosh Horror Film Festival was called Cluster. Now, Cluster was a visual metaphor, kind of an artsy film uh, representation of migraines. Now, it basically starts two people. Uh, you got Reed McIver, who uh, Mick Iver, who plays uh, the guy who's suffering from the migraines, and Roger Garcia, who's the manifestation of the pain. I really like, wow, this one really built up as it goes and really did a good job of trying to convey that feeling of what people have when they get migraines. You know, just that sharp pain and putting it in a visual metaphor of a killer trying to kill this guy uh, when he's actually suffering from a migraine is just a great visual metaphor and, and excellently represented in this film. Another lower budget film, uh, but still a lot of fun, really. A lot of these uh, aren't made with a lot of money, just a lot of heart and a lot of passion, and that does come across on the screen, and Cluster definitely has both in it. It's got a little bit of uh, artsiness to it, but nothing too uh, bizarre or, or too out there to where you can't follow it, okay? So definitely look for Cluster as well at a festival near you. Uh, great visual metaphor for migraines. And then you got the Barbecue Massacre, which will definitely make you question purchasing an RV. And then I'll about do it for us here at the Final Cut. Until next time, keep that ticket stuff.